like this though. I understand you want the best for me, and I understand that. But at the same time, even if I don't do anything with my education, you don't do that to nobody. You know what I'm saying? Because you, you know, wait. Let me let me say this. Can you turn that down a little bit? Because I don't want to sound like I'm hollering. Because you don't know what somebody going through mentally. I can go home right now and blow my brains out because of the shit that I go through. And you don't you don't understand. It's like you don't you don't know because I don't I don't I don't bubble uh I don't uh articulate articulate and no no that's not what I'm trying to say. I don't vocal everything that I go through to people or whatever. I keep all my stuff, you know, to me. And that's one of my problems too. And that's why, you know, I'm so angry because, you know, I, I hold everything yeah, or whatever. But at the same time, that's besides that that's a, a side note. But at the same time, you don't do that. You don't badger people about their downfalls. That's not healthy. That is not healthy. That is not a healthy behavior or whatever. When you all the time, you know, like, it's almost like you putting it, throwing it in my face. Oh, you know, and, and you might not mean to do that, but that's what it is. That's why I'm telling you, you know, about it, because you might not mean to to throw it in my face, but that's what you're doing. What you're doing with your education every time. You know what I'm saying? Like I every time, every time it's ever and I'm not even exaggerating. Every time we we around each other, that's that's what you say. What well, what are you doing with your education? What and I understand, you know, you want me to, you know, do something with myself and, and, and to the outside or whatever, and to every day or whatever people maybe or to you, it might might not seem like you you might seem like I'm giving up, and to you that might be your your way of trying to encourage me, but that's not encouraging. What you need to turn down here, Daddy. We going on Foster. Where you going? Mm -hmm. Well, baby, you need to turn down here. We going on North Foster. You know where you take me to North Foster. And you know when when you say that every time or whatever, you know that trigger. That's a trigger for me because you know it's all. It's like I'm already going through a lot. It's it's like I already feel like I don't have you know, any, anything, anything anymore. Anyway, I, every day I wake up and I'll be like, but well, damn, I don't have my car. You don't think I want a car. You know, in certain situations, certain, certain circumstances, the reason why, you know, I don't have a car, you don't know that people come on, come and trespass on that property and, you know, try to do stuff to me. You don't know that. T don't even know that because well, I don't, tell, you got tell people. but I don't, I don't want to tell nobody. You should. I don't want to tell nobody because it ain't gonna do nothing. You well, what's the point? You know what I'm saying or whatever. But whether I tell somebody or not, the the fact of the matter is, there's a reason for every day I've got the on thing. And I, what I need you to do as my daddy, if you really love me like you say you do, what I need you to do is as my daddy to trust me, because right now I don't need nobody to tell me anything, because. And I'm, I'm not saying that to say, oh, well, you know, you think you all that you think, you know, you better than this or you think this, that you think that about yourself. I don't want to hear that. Right now, it's a pivotal time for me. And, you know, right now, I, I trust myself. I don't trust. I don't trust too much. And if you want to do anything for me, all you got to do is trust me. That's it. That's all. If you want to do anything for me, I don't need you to say nothing. I don't need you to buy me anything. I don't need you to give me any money. Right now, I don't need you to do anything but to trust me. And, you know, if I reach out to you or whatever, and then, you know, act accordingly if you can. But I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't need, I don't need negativity. Evelyn is the most negative person I do in my life. And for the outside world and for other people, you'll never think that. But but staying in that house and living with her, I learned that because I used to go to her for everything that I needed emotionally because I thought that was like my my second, my third mother. 
you know, you know how it was. Like, like you, you go to Evelyn's house and you eat. You know, that's how I used to be. I used to eat. I used to sit down. I used to give a, you know, okay, you give us some gas money or, you know, or see you got some gas money or, you know, whatever. But I had to learn that people ain't for you, and it it be your family members. It don't, you know what I'm saying? Yo, for some of the family members, it be the worst people in the world that you can have actively in your life. And you might not understand. You might not believe me. I don't give a damn if nobody understands me or if nobody believes me. Excuse my French and Spanish. But I'm speaking stuff that I've learned and that I lived on my own. Myself. I'm not speaking self-experience. I'm not speaking for, okay, I feel a certain type of way because I'm upset or, you know, I feel some type of way or whatever. I'm just saying this because I want somebody to look bad. Keep straight. You don't want, you, you, you losing it too because, no, that's, that's not it. You know the one that I always go to. See, that's what I'm saying. And it's just like little stuff or whatever. But anyway, like I was saying, family members, some of the family members sometimes is the worst people in the world you can have in your life to listen to. But right now I don't have a choice. I have to be, you know, in that house. But what I'm saying, what I'm trying to convey to you is, please, cause I don't wanna, you know, I don't, I don't wanna be mean to everybody. I, I don't like being like that, but sometimes I gotta be like that. And I don't wanna every time be upset at you every time I get around you. I don't wanna want act like that. So that's why I'm telling you, stop asking me that. Right yeah, right here. Stop asking me that because there's a reason why I do what I do. 